Fighting terrorism. That's the goal these young men and women have set themselves. After several months of intensive training, they are now entering the border police. During the ceremony with their families and commanders, these young Israelis receive the uniform they have been waiting for. These security forces know their missions will be more than complex. Some even left New York to confront the reality on the ground. Of course, you know, protecting the different settlements throughout the Shamron. Um, multiple Israeli cities that are under constant threat throughout their day-to-day -day activities and you know keeping those citizens safe being the best operator possible in order to protect the people who are living there. Um, I know civilians are constantly under threat throughout those areas so just being able to be kind of a step ahead of the curb as far as you know different uh, threats. They will therefore be on the front line to protect the lives of Israelis as mentioned by the international spokesman of the Israeli police. We just finished the graduation ceremony for the Israel border police. The recruits today are wearing dress uniforms. Tomorrow, they're going to be wearing vests out in the field defending Israel. They are on the front lines. Their families here came to support them, to show them love. And it's our duty to continue to show them love throughout their service. They put their life on the line to combat terror to protect us all so that we can sleep at home at night peacefully while they're doing all the hard work. These young people joined the border police during an almost daily wave of terrorism just before the Muslim holy month of Ramadan, which will begin in 10 days, which often brings with it an upsurge in violence.